What's poppin' homies? It's your favorite homegirl, Gossip Girl. So I'm coming in with some news today because you know what? There's a lot of attacks going on, okay? A lot of attacks going on. In New York City, people are attacking the Asians. In China, they're attacking um the Africans. It's just ridiculous. It's going on. But in Florida, Orlando, Florida, that is, a woman is attacked in the grocery store because she's wearing scrubs. So let's get into this conversation and this article, okay? It says here, a woman in scrubs attacked in the supermarket aisle. Julianne Roberts from Orlando, Florida says she and a friend had stopped by a Winn-Dixie grocery store after she left the hearing aid practice where she works as an audiologist. Okay. A woman in a gray shirt um, confronted the pair. We've just left work and picking up a few items for our family. Miss Roberts can be heard telling the stranger. Miss Roberts said, the woman said to, it was not right for her to wear her scrubs in the grocery store because she could spread the plague. The audiologist said she tried to explain to the woman that she did not work in a hospital nor a doctor's office. Ms. Roberts said her practice has barely seen any patients and is on the verge of closing because of the pandemic. The irate shopper threatened to call the police, but the incident was de-escalated by a manager who asked the women to remain on separate sides of the store. After the encounter, Ms. Roberts said she realized we're in the middle of a pandemic and people are scared, and that's got to be why that lady is behaving the way she is. Nurses and doctors deserve to go shopping also, and I would trust they're following the right procedures when they go out in public. Please do not be so scared. We're all in this together. Everyone has the same fears as you do. Well, I understand, you know, even though the lady that was attacked, she's still trying to be, you know, sensible and reasonable and trying to talk to the lady. But I think the lady that was that wanted to attack her and say nasty stuff and say she could spread the plague, whatever. I think she's just being ignorant, okay? I'm pretty sure there are a lot of doctors and nurses out there that go to the grocery stores. And I'm pretty sure they know what precautions to take. I mean, when people become fearful of things, it opens up an ugly, uh, uglier side of them. And it's not with all people. I'm just gonna say with some. When some people are really scared, it opens up a, a, a uglier side of them, okay, that you have probably never seen or never thought <laughs> they can, you know, or even thought of. But my thing is, first of all, I'm not going to attack nobody. I'm not going to confront anybody. I'm trying to keep my distance. That's why social distance is, is in a place. It's in place now. I'm not going to go up there and try to attack nobody. If I see somebody with a uniform on or whatever the case may be and i fear say if i'm scared to death i'm fearful that they work in a hospital do you actually think i'm going to walk up to them and tell them how i feel about them wearing scrubs in the store no me the way my mind work if i'm in fear of something i avoid it i try to avoid it i would probably put my basket down and leave the store or spray <laughs> light soil all over me you know what I'm saying? Because I still got to get things from my family. People, you have to deal with things in a fashionable manner. Maybe that's not the right word for it, but I'm just saying you have to deal with things accordingly. You cannot be up here attacking people. You can't confront people um, because you think they got the plague and they got to spread it. You, you got you to gotta be smarter than that. You have to. There's so much stuff going on in this world that it's just crazy. It's crazy. I mean, crime is going up. I said it last night. Crime has gone up a lot. Okay. It's just really, really crazy. I don't understand why she did it. But, um, it just, it's just ridiculous right now. So, because she's wearing scrubs, because she's wearing scrubs, you feel like it's necessary for you to go and attack her and say nasty things and tell you you're going to call the police and all that kind of stuff. Come on now. Come on. We can't tell doctors and nurses not to come in the store because they got on scrubs. We can't do that. People who are home attendants wear scrubs because they don't want to wear their nicer clothes outside. So they wear, they wear scrubs. Personal care assistants or care aides, they wear scrubs, okay, because they don't want to wear 
that's first of all, that's probably the proper thing to wear because you don't want to wear regular clothes to work. Or it depends on your client, the, the patient that you're taking care of. If they want you to wear scrubs, you wear scrubs. If you, they want you to wear your, their reg, your regular clothes, you wear your regular clothes because um, they don't want to look like they have a nurse. Okay? Some people are like that. They don't want to look like they have a nurse, so they ask you to please wear regular clothes. But if you're working for an agency and your requirement is to wear scrubs, you have to wear scrubs. So because somebody's wearing scrubs, you're going to attack them. That's stupidity on your level. That's dumb. That's really dumb. You know, I'm just so sick and tired of ignorance. It just really, it just really blows my mind how people are out here just, how they acting. It just really blows my mind. I, I just don't get it. I just don't get it. Hmm. Well, anyway, guys, you have a great day. Happy Monday to you all. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. If you like my channel, please stick around. I'm almost close to my watch time. So I would appreciate if you keep watching some of my other videos. It helps bring up my watch time hours. I really do appreciate it. But I also pre all, appreciate all of you who's been rocking with your girl. I look in the comments and I see. I may not comment all the time. But I know my regular people. And I'm like, I, I thank y'all for that. And once I get to the point where I got my watch time hours, I am going to do a nice little giveaway. Um, Believe me, it's going to be a cash app or PayPal giveaway. Because I like to give back. You gave me your time, so I feel like it's my time to give back. And that's what it's all about. So, thank you for rocking with your girl. I hope you guys have a great Monday. And I will be back later with some news, I guess. Um, or whatever's going on, because it's been kind of dry. <laughs> um, but anyway, you guys have a good one. Bye.